shark bit it. That's what I think. The shark said I'm hungry. What's, What's up, up everybody? everybody? I'm Daryl. And I'm Marie. And this is DM's Mix Up. Welcome back to DM's Mix Up, guys. We're back out at the beach today. We actually got out here at low tide, so it looks like there's no water. At first it looked like it was ice or something. So I don't know if you can see it or not. I'm gonna walk down here as far as I can, but there's the, there's a wall directly out there. Don't get too close into it because that is mud. Sorry about the wind, guys. I'm wet. We found a really large sign right here. Keep off the beach. And it it looks like it says keep off the beach, but Yeah, right there it says keep something beach. Something A shark bit it. That's what I think. A shark said I'm Just walking along the beach, seeing if we can see anything on the surface, cool rocks, different stuff. And then we're gonna go grab the metal detectors and bring them out. <laughs> Too late, it's already being recorded. I know. Delilah, come here and look at this. Yo, these things are creepy. I think I got it in here. Watch your feet. Look at that. It's a flat piece of metal. No idea what that is. See it? It's a little. I have no idea what it is. It doesn't look that sharp on the edges. No, because at first I thought maybe it might have been a blade, like a um, a knife, but it's like really thin. 
can we just take a second to look at how awesome these creatures are like it's got all these protective mechanisms it's shanking me in my hand to like yeah. protect itself and stuff from predators it looks like a dinosaur a dinosaur <laughs> you um you remember when we went to uh, that one beach and like they've got that thing the giant sign that teaches you about horses yeah there's you know? one right up there yeah i actually read those like i normally read them it tells you actually some pretty interesting information about horses yeah. And like when you say horseshoe crabs, if you look at the way that they move, they're like nine times out of ten, they're in protective mode, and they're trying to protect like their mouth and their rib cage area. Right. And that don't always help. Plus, it's possible that um, their tails can end up breaking off. This one didn't die so long ago either. That's so sad. Yep. Uh, who knows? This could be a combination of things. They could be looking for more breeding ground areas. Or just... It could be from them... Well, when when they die on the beach, people will throw them up, up here to keep them from being directly on the beach. I don't know what they are. No idea what this is. It's saying it's a pull tab. That's kind of cool looking. It's um, copper because it's green. It's turning green. No idea what that is. It looks like copper. It's turning green. Yeah, I know, but I'm talking about the design. Oh. I was like, what do you mean you don't know what it is? I just told you it looks like copper. <laughs> yeah, but like it looks like it was attached to something, like a design on something. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Cool little find. That looks maybe a little bit better. It don't need to be up that far. I mean, closer look, dudes. Go. Mm. I don't think there's anything else in here. Just press the button. It's already on. You should press the button. Do you have to press no. the button? No. Okay. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else here. You don't have to touch the sand with it. You were. Hello? That's iron. Ah. Keep being haunted by the thing that I keep hearing from other folks that metal detect, and that is dig everything.
Oh yeah. This one reminds me of cobblestone. What is that that you just grabbed? I'm getting a lot of signals in this hole. <laughs> Let's use the pinpointer. It almost looks like onyx, but it's just because it's wet. Is it wet? A little bit. Damp? A little bit. As soon as I can clean it off, I'll dry it off. I love how I just casually display my Naruto shirt. Naruto's a great anime watching people. No, I just wasn't going down far enough. Jeez, dude. Apparently I still didn't go down far enough. That's what we're here for. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, maybe we found it. Yeah, look, it's right there. Oh, there it is. Is that it? Yeah, pull it out. Oh, that is metal. It looks like sheet metal. It's very flimsy and easy to cut yourself on, so be careful. That is my magic wand. Yeah, looks like aluminum, maybe. Maybe. It looks more like sheet metal. Like you heat it up and then like press it onto something. Yeah, it's like a really thin, thin layer. Oh well, it's going in the bag. We'll get rid of it. All right. Let's fill in the hole. And move on. That is like the second or third piece. I know, right? They're just like completely flat and colored. I mean, they look cool. Because, like, they're not very huge, but they're colored. And flat. And smooth. Kind of. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, time to dig. <laughs> dig away. I might actually it might actually be back this way a little bit. Because it, when the metal gets close to the edge of the detector ring, that's when you start picking it up. Keep going. That's it. There's nothing there. Right there. There's nothing there either. It's in here. Oh, that ringing. It's right here, somewhere. Alright, so I think it's down a little bit further with your scooter. I feel like it's a pole or something. Obviously.
obviously I missed it. Hold that. All right, now do it. Another piece of metal. I told you, man. Time to go find the next piece of sheet metal. It's pretty blue writing on it, and it's gray. Oh my gosh, there's a dog. Come here, my love. Oh. This looks like it might be a beer can. Thanks for watching our video. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more content.